morning folks, I haven't done one of these in a while but, uh, just to show you what's going off you see the little midge look come out to play with me today um, where to start see we've got some onions in there some broad beans which I'll be planting some more today getting this bed ready for putting peas in that's if she'll keep off it. Yeah. Perpetual spinach. Amongst other things. But this is the main thing. This is what we've been doing. Is this. I'm building a polytunnel. Posh one at that. Four metres wide. 8 metres long into 3 beds in it when we've done uh, this is on the site where the original polytunnel was well that small one see the small one that's up there in the distance that used to be down here but anyway the main focus today is to get some uh, peas and broad beans in the ground that's if Midge will leave me alone long enough to do it but we'll see Go on. yeah it's a bit, a bit of a strange one this year always tying off work But it's given me time to catch a punk garden, if no it helps. Like these root trainers, they always produce a nice plant. that part I don't know if that's right it's just our ideal Lovely day, nice to have sun on your back for a change. One off. She's off. She can hear neighbours. She can hear neighbours moving dustbins. And no doubt she can hit neighbours' dogs and all. <coughs> yeah, so we're going to try and grow even more food this year once we get the polyton up and running. Um, so we designed the polyton all around the polyton so we can water and. Um, electric in there so hopefully we'll be able to keep everything warm over winter and there's some nice winter crops and uh, as daft as it sounds but I think a bit of food sovereignty in this current climate can't be a bad thing see if you go into the shop Max is really gardener I'm more of a uh, build it type guy but she leaves me in when she goes to work because she works three days a week same as I do um, she always leaves me instructions 
or what's, what needs planting and where. Take these back. And, uh, chicken is still He's still doing all right. Take compost bins along here. Long fence on there. And here we are. We're just using this for bringing seedlings and that on. And look. But eventually, this is where pumpkins and uh, squashes will go. And what we'll do is um, take the cover off and grow what, pumpkins and squashes up the frame I've got the watering can so I'll go and uh, water these beans in peas rather you can see it's a lovely day You can see from the pilot tunnel up about we've put a door on either end so you can walk through. But we'll also put this path in here look. And we can get down. So I'll give these water in. And perhaps we'll uh,
quite good, don't they? And there's look and inspection. Oi, keep your nose out, you. Keep your nose out. I think that would be. Anyway, I'm going to find another little job to do.